I'm feeling inspired today, so we're going to do another Living Dead Dolls makeup look, and I'm going to do Mishka, which is one that I've been wanting to do forever, but I'm kind of scared of the whole full coverage face paint thing, but today I think I'm ready to try it. Mishka is not one that I own, but I think she's super cute because she kind of has this like werewolf vibe to her, and I love the green and the flannel, which is why I'm wearing this. So that's enough of that let's just go ahead and get started I'm gonna be using this fab face paint here and I'm gonna use a sponge it's not like a beauty blender it's like a spongy sponge like an old-school foundation sponge I am gonna prime my eyes first And I think I want to try the glue. I think I want to try the glue again. Just here on the ends. I've tried gluing down my eyebrows before, but it just doesn't quite work for me. Maybe it'll work this time. <laughs> it's water activated. And I've been watching videos on how to properly use this kind of stuff. So. Look at that. <laughs> here we go. Okay, I think I finally figured out how to use this face paint. It looks really cool. It's crazy. I feel like I can't move my face though. Alright, I'm going to touch up a little bit along the hairline. And then we'll be done with this. Mishka does have a green neck. So, I'm going to make my neck green. I'm not cutting corners anymore. Okay, next I think I'm just gonna go ahead and do the eyebrows. First I think I'm gonna sketch them with my very skinny um, eyebrow pencil. It's hard to use pencil on this face paint. So I'm ready to just go ahead and go in with a liquid pencil, an eyeliner pen, I don't know. Now, I'm going to take a brush, a flat brush, and go in and just try to cover up my eyebrow hairs. Alright, now it's time for eyeshadow. And Mishka just has a lot of smudged black around her eyes, so that'll be easy. Let me zoom you in. Okay, now I'm gonna do her eyeliner. Like many Living Dead dolls, she has like a triple wing, quadruple wing. I think for this, I'm just gonna go with the triple wing. So much black eyeshadow on that it's kind of hard to even see the wings so I don't think I'm gonna worry too much about them 
I'm going to go in on the water line now. And now just some mascara. Maybe ultimately this look would be cutest with some false lashes. I'm just not sure. There's so much black around the eyes that it's hard to discern eyeliner and eyelashes. Okay, now it's time for the part that I've pretty much been most looking forward to, and that's the widow's peak. Let me zoom you out a little bit for this. Okay, now it's time for the hard part, the mouth. Um, so I think I'm gonna start off with the little frowny lines she has on the sides of her mouth. Now for her teeth. What I'm gonna do is take my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil and do a layer of white on my bottom lip. And she has five teeth. So wish me luck. Now, I'm gonna finish the black lipstick. Okay, I think we're done. And I'm scared to talk, <laughs> but it looks really cool. And one last touch, I'm not really sure if it's even necessary but I'm gonna take some white liquid eyeliner and just brighten up the teeth a little bit. Okay, the only thing that I honestly feel like I'm missing is that I don't have the same color eyes as her, so I can't really bring that golden brown color to this look. But here we go, I am Mishka. I just think I'm gonna go put on some overalls to really Finish it off. I'll be back. Okay. Mishka, the little trick-or-treater, is done. This was super fun. This is so cool. All right. Mishka is ready to go trick-or-treating. I hope it was fun to watch. Definitely one of the most rewarding looks I have tried. I think I'm finally getting the hang of this face paint. Well, that's it for today. Bye.